Wall Street Memes Casino. I'm fine. And Sportsbook. This is Joe Pooh for IFL TV. Um, we won't mention what just happened there. Uh, but Dan, how are you, mate? It's been a couple months. Feeling good? Yeah, good to be back in uh, Bolton, where the professional journey started five months ago. Last time I stole the show, and that's what I intend to do again on uh, Friday night. Has it only been five months? Six months, maybe five, six months. I had my debut the 1st of December. What's it now, June? So about, about six months. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's like you've been around a while already, mate. Yeah, I'm getting about wasm and are uh, keeping me active, and that's what I want. Um, yeah, look, I think every time Kala, Nissa, anyone from Wasserman um, talk about their stable, I think you're one of the first names that are brought up for being a real star of the future. Um, how pleased are you that they are getting behind you like they have been? Definitely, yeah. Uh, it's great to have a button from uh, Wasman, my trainer Dave Colwell, and of course Sam Jones as well. But uh, the belief that I have in myself, I believe I'm going to be. I believe I, believe I am the real deal, and uh, going to be a real problem in the 154 division. Yeah, your last fight was your first fight with Dave Colwell. Um, does it feel like it's really gelling now? You've really got a good relationship. Uh, we gelled straight away. You know, we're both on the same page. When I come down, and have my first session with Dave at the start of uh, January. But uh, last fight, we had five weeks with Dave. Now it's about five months. So you're going to see the difference on Friday night. You know, I feel like I'm really developing and uh, coming along. Uh, great setup now. Great setup with Dave. Great setup with strength and conditioning, boxing science. Really filling out, developing, and uh, looking forward to my best performance yet on Friday. Is that the switch? When you made it to Dave Colwell, is that just that extra thing you needed just to really translate over to the pros? The proof's in the pudding with Dave and he's been there and done it, been involved in some of the biggest fights uh, this country's seen in the last 10 years. You know, a uh, brilliant trainer. And yeah, I'm just looking at a uh, show on Friday night, the uh, things that me and Dave have been working on in the gym. Dave's gym's always been a good environment. It seems, seems like that from the outside looking in anyway. Do you enjoy that? being around other fighters and just it looks like a good laugh really you're who you surround yourself with you know obviously it's a good laugh but uh when it's time to get down the business you know it's uh the hard work gets done in the gym and uh was it now three three months since my last fight three months of hard work i've been in the gym you know and uh yeah ready to put it all in action friday night do you identify certain things that you want to improve on fight by fight it's not about changing your style, you know, that's the thing with Dave. Uh, he's not about changing my style. You can never get away from what I was, what I come through with the amateur, amateurs, with the pedigree I brung, you know, the style, what got me to where I am now. It's just about developing and uh, making them adjustments so I'm more, uh, more adjusted to the pro ranks. Obviously, your manager, Sam Jones, don't shut up about you, uh, rightly so. But is it going to be hard to kind of keep you at a slow pace if you do put in these show stealing performances? If you look at my resume, um, I've never fought a fighter that hasn't had a winning record. And uh, Friday night, I fight another fighter with a winning record of 10 wins, two losses, two draws. I think that says a lot about the belief that Dave and Sam have me, having me, and even the belief I have in myself. You know, like I said before, I believe I'm going to be the, I believe I am the real deal, and I'm going to be a real problem in the 154 division. You look at the very, very top, and I know it might seem a long way off, but if you are where you believe you are. You look at like Crawford Madrimov, which is the top of the fight. Realistically, do you think like it is only a matter of time before you are there? Yeah, definitely, of course. But uh, Friday night's the main priority. Let's do Friday night first. Then, we'll, then we'll talk about titles and talk about other <laughs> things. Yeah, not quite Crawford yet, but we'll get there. We'll get there. We'll get there. All in good time, Dan. Thank you very much for speaking to IFL TV. Best of luck on Friday night, and hopefully see you put in another great performance. Cheers, mate. Tune in Friday night. Thank you. Thank you very much, Dan. Wall Street Memes Casino. I'm fine. And Sportsbook.